Hello Aquarius, welcome to the channel. I hope you're all doing well and thank you for your likes, shares and subscribes. Please remember this is a general reading. It will not resonate with everyone. You can look at your moon and rising signs. These messages might suit you better. This is a timeless reading, so when you're drawn to it is when you're meant to hear it. We have message in a bottle. So there's news coming in. It could be spirit bringing you news. This is success. It's going to move you forward. Six is a success. So the good news, the answers, whatever you're looking for is coming in. A transformation. There's change coming. So this news is going to be welcoming news. It could change everything here. This is like uh, Scorpio energy, the death card. Out with the old and in with the new. Compromise. Now, compromise isn't about giving in. It's about finding the middle ground. It's about balancing things out, finding the way forward so that you can go on to achieve here. So it's not weakness. It's not a sign of weakness to compromise. Let's have a look and see what this is all about. Show me clearly, Spirit. The Hermit, Virgo energy. Keep dealing with a Virgo. Six of Wands. The Ten of Cups. Seven of Wands. King of Swords, overall central energy. The Knight of Cups. The beautiful Empress. Five of Swords, and there's your Compromise card. I just had this Compromise out for Gemini, I think. And the Nine of Cups. So what we've got here is we've got to do a bit of soul searching here. We need to get the right information here. We need to gather ourselves. We need to f listen to our intuition. We need to take ourselves away on our own and we need to do the soul searching here. We could take a walk. It could be a weekend away. But it's a very soul type of energy. We need to go away on our own to seek the answers that's needed here so that we can compromise and move on. Now, this is a bittersweet victory. You're not going to come out with everything that you want in this situation. But if you can compromise and find that middle ground, it's going to change everything for you and you're going to move forward after doing it. So this can feel like a bittersweet victory. You could be taking one step back to take two steps forward and there can be a feeling of loss with this. It can feel as if you're being cheated out of something or feel you're leaving something behind you'd rather take with you. Uh, but there's feeling of, I'm not coming out with everything I really desire, but I'm prepared to cut my losses to bring in the change because fives are change. So what you're doing is you're seeking out the answers for you. They're inside you here. Um, now, this could also be some sort of advice that you're getting, legal advice, financial advice, some sort of somebody's bringing you information, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius energy, or it could be you getting the clarity you need and speaking up here about what you're prepared to do. Now, it could also be you chatting with someone else who's outside the situation, who's got a clearer picture of it that could help you here. Just listening, listening to you so you can thrash things out here, you can get the clarity you need. But whatever's happening here, you're going to have to find a compromise. You're going to have to find a way of listening to your intuition to find that middle ground here. And you're either going to be taking advice, you're going to be announcing it, or you're going to be, somebody's going to be a good listener for you here. And what happens is you can move forward towards victory and success, literally. There'll be a change. So you're going from a five to a six here. And then we're going on to a seven. So you will get this. You will find the middle ground. You will make the right compromises. You will go forward to overcome these challenges. You're going to go forward to success. This could be hiccups. It could be waiting on news coming in. It could be legal situations that you're waiting to come to fruition. Uh, it could be advice you're waiting on, news of any kind, but it's going to transform things. And when this news comes in or this uh, compromise takes place, this movement forward, you're going to go on to success and victory and people are going to respect you here. There's public recognition. And six is, I always say, attracting more success. So there's only more victory to come. So this is a determination here. Um, you could be speaking up. You might have to speak up. Uh, I wouldn't fight against this. This is about finding compromise, remember, so don't be fighting against the tide here. 
you have to find that middle ground, but you're determined here to move on. There's a determination to move on, to bring success and to keep going. Once you see the victory that you're coming out with and the path forward, you're going to want to keep going. You've got the upper hand now. You're going to want to keep going and put the efforts in. You're going to want a taste of more victory, uh, you know, in the future. So this is going to be you moving you towards, this is a way to move you towards happiness. So like I say, somebody could bring in good news. It could be a Cancer, Pisces or Scorpio energy. This could be somebody who's got your back, who's looking out for you here. It could be a good friend, support network, a good boss. It could be a family member of any kind. But there's good people around you. And this is welcoming news. It could be somebody bringing you the welcoming news that you're looking for. And this is going to bring a lot of happiness and contentment into your life. We're going from the nine to the ten. And because you've been prepared to find that middle ground here, the rewards will come, the blessings will come, the victories, the success will come in. You'll find contentment and happiness and there'll be lots of blessings after this challenging time for you or your family or your soul tribe. Now, there's rebirth and rejuvenation. That's what this is going to bring. The change here is going to be rebirth and rejuvenation. So this could be, for example, somebody could, uh, there could be pregnancy for some people as well here, definitely. But you're creating beautiful things. You're being successful in overcoming these things, uh, this situation, however it resonates with you. You've been prepared to cut your losses here. And that enables you to go on to create beautiful things. And compromise here as well is about compassion. And she's love. She's Venus, she's love. If I say he or she, it's not a gender specific reading. I'm talking about the energies on the cards. But she's love. She's harmony. She's rebirth, rejuvenation, creating beautiful things around you because you've been fair, you've done the right thing here and you've found that middle ground. And there we go. New opportunities for happiness are coming in. Things, New things will present themselves. You'll only go on to find more success and more happiness in the future. So this is not a time to be worrying about things. This is unnecessary worry. And the reason we say that is because worry doesn't resolve anything. So don't worry about this. Um, deal with it. Understand here that this is part of your lessons. Don't put your own endings on things. Take a step back and listen to your intuition. Listen to your heart chakra. There could be apologies involved in this as well. This could be due to do with a younger person as well. But your traditional values will serve you well. Definitely. Now, there could be new opportunities here um, for love. Uh, it could be new opportunities for jobs, education, whatever this new opportunity is being presented to you, you're going to enjoy it. So whether you're successful in a relationship, whether you're successful in a new job, you're successful in education, whatever this may be, as long as you're your true authentic self. And we did mention you're coming from your heart chakra and you're showing compassion, you will find a lot of success. And there we go. The King of Pentacles is somebody who commits to things. So he commits, he works hard, he does what's necessary here for him to achieve his stability in the future. So you're finding the compromise now, but the rewards are going to be massive because you're going to create great stability for yourself. And this could be this could be things like promotion. This could be like security, financial security, feeling secure in your house, your relationships, whatever it may be. But this is definitely going to be the way forward for you. You will not regret making these compromises. The rewards are definitely there. Signs. Your past loved ones are never far from you. Notice the signs they send. Now this can be repeating messages, repeating songs, feathers, birds, passion. Passion. Passion isn't confined to sexual energy. Life is meant to be felt. Don't hold back. Go for it. Do what you need to do here to, to keep going to achieve whatever it is you're wanting to achieve. I hope this helps. Please like, share and subscribe and I'll see you again soon. Bye bye.